Hi, my name is Mylan Kaufman, and I'm a senior at Omaha Central. <laughs> and this is my poem called 11818, Not Better, Just Different. Mom jeans look like defeat. Mom jeans smell like Abercrombie and Fitch. He likes mom jeans, he likes mom jeans, he likes mom jeans. Mom, can we go to JCPenney? Yes. Mom jeans feel like a comfort zone everyone is in but me. Mom jeans taste like morning breath I didn't eat last night. Mom jeans, mom jeans, mom jeans, why? Am I crying over mom jeans? She's cute. I'm sure she's adorable. Are they ripped, dark wash, light wash, rolled up, thrifted, Danzig is a city, why? Don't I have any mom jeans? I am obsessive. I can't wear mom jeans because of the outline of my stomach. I can't wear mom jeans because my legs are too short and my torso is long. It's called boshing Maslow's hierarchy. I can wear mom jeans. They need to be huge, slightly ripped, and I'll wear them with Converse. <laughs> what am I doing? This isn't about him anymore. This is about my obsession with how I don't exist right. I need to lose weight, she says. No, you don't. Where did you get your mom jeans? <clears throat> 450 is money. 450 is yours. I learned that in fourth grade. I exist wrong. <laughs> Five, seven, fat, men are afraid to catcall me. Don't get me wrong, I'm not complaining, but I know girls who have guys confessing their love for her left and right. I sympathize with them, I truly do, but to an insecure touch starved fatso, it'd be so much better. It'd be so different. It would be different to have men at my disposal. I can't help but envy them in their mom jeans. Update, three weeks later. I got a pair of mom jeans that night and he didn't even look at me. <laughs> Did you think I'd be hurt? <laughs> you were right. But give or take three hours, these thoughts I have at midnight don't define me and I probably will obsess over something trifling again, but I will never let my pants size make me write a poem again.